Hey guys, this is Patty B within the hauler. I got another firearm I'd like to share with y'all. This is my FN model 1922. Chambered in 7.65 Browning, or is what we call in the United States 32 ACP. Uh, we'll go ahead and check it real quick, quick, make sure she's clear. And she is. Uh, so this is the magazine fed, striker fired, blowback operated uh, semi-auto pistol uh, based on FN's model 1910. Uh, designed by the great John Moses Browning. Uh, the FN Model 1910 is kind of infamous. Uh, it was the pistol uh, that was used to assassinate the Austro-Hungarian Franz Ferdinand, his wife Sophie, which was kind of the spark to start World War I. Uh, but that's another story. Uh, but the, uh, the Belgians took the pocket pistol, which was the 1910, and to try to get military contracts with it, they added uh, a longer grip here where you could hold two more rounds, uh, at least in the 32 ACP, and then they added almost an inch to the barrel and installed this barrel extension, making it a little bit bigger and uh, more suitable for military use. And it was adopted by several European countries for military uh, military use. Um, then, of course, in you know, 1940, the uh, German military invaded Belgium, and Belgium was a uh, course making these at the time so the Germans thought it'd be a good idea for them to keep making them but let's go ahead and use them for German use so I don't know if it'll come through or not but this model was actually marked you know for the German uh, Wehrmacht the German army it's got Waffen amps and such I'll give you a close look up at it uh, some of the features on this on this pistol We've got a heel release and a nine round magazine, at least in 32 ACP. I think in 380 it's going to hold one or two less. Uh, you've got a grip safety and a lever safety. The, uh, I think the uh, lever safety here, all it does is block you from being able to push the, uh, the grip safety there. Uh, the sights on it are uh, boy, what you'd expect on a little pocket pistol. They're pretty small and hard to see. Um, usable, but man, they're just, they're kind of small. Um, and then up here you can see this barrel extension, which is just held on by this lever right here. Uh, disassembly on this uh, pistol is not too bad. Uh, we'll go ahead and do that now. Like I said, we'll go ahead and clear it. Remove the uh, magazine. Push this little level lever on your barrel extension, rotate it, and boom, that pops right out. And we can put it in its disassembly position, rotate the barrel, and then the whole slide comes right out. So we got the barrel removed. You can kind of see the lugs it's got on the bottom of the barrel and they match up with the uh, corresponding grooves in the frame down here. So you've got your striker spring and then your striker. A pretty easy disassembly. Um, you could take the grips off and get in there a little bit more but that's all we're going to do today. So installation you know it's just the uh, opposite put in our striker we'll have to rotate those lugs out of the way There you go. Oh. Pretty simple. Um, you know, these days a lot of people, uh, you know, don't think a whole lot of 32 ACP, which it's not a powerhouse for sure, but you know, most of Europe didn't have any issues with it uh, last century for both police work and military work. Uh, what I like for 32 ACP is it's nice, mild recoil. Um, 
you know, it doesn't shoot much harder than a 22, which just it makes it fun to shoot. So, well, speaking of fun to shoot, let's go outside and see how this little thing does. All right, let's take some shots. Uh, oh, here about five yards with the uh, FN 1922. Man, nothing like 32 ACP for hardly any recoil. I don't know how much the uh, 32 ACP can move those plates on a tree, but we'll try to run that tree, see what happens. Yeah, I moved him a little. Back here on the deck about 15 yards so let's uh, see how she does all right not too bad all right we'll try this thing uh, that's about 30 to 35 yards out there uh, we'll see what we can do with this thing at that range Not bad, not bad, FN 1922. All right, so we just got back inside from uh, shooting the FN model 1922, and uh, man, it's just fun. You know, the uh, 32 ACP, you know, it's not really a man stopper, but you know, when you're out planking outside, 38, 32 ACP is as much fun as, as anything. Um, super soft recoil, um, you know, hits a little harder than a 22, but you can shoot it all day. It's just a lot of fun. And anytime you get to take an old war horse out, you know, it's got some history to it. You know, a pistol designed by uh, possibly the greatest American gun designer, manufactured in Belgium, and then taken over by the uh, Nazis and manufactured for them by FN until the war was over. It's just got a lot of cool history, you know, and uh, it's fun to shoot. Um, some of my takeaways are the uh, grip spring, it's a little stout. You kind of have to concentrate on squeezing that grip or, you know, the trigger won't, uh, won't go off. Uh, the sights, uh, pretty small, um, you know, kind of hard to shoot quick, but, you know, you get them lined up and it's going to hit where you want it to hit. So, there you go, guys. Fun afternoon shooting the FN 1922. All right, y'all have a nice day.